It is quarter to six in the morning. I know I'm a little early, but it's also a little late, considering that I haven't slept all night again. Um, yeah, it's uh, February 1st. Uh, we're beginning our new month. Uh, I didn't really do that much um, today. It was more of a survey day and a reading day than anything else. Uh, I looked around on YouTube to see uh, what everyone else is doing on there. So I checked my usual channels, Nerds OL and uh, Right and Proper Ladies, and then sort of went out from, went out from there. Uh, as I was watching uh, Nerds OL, uh, I saw that they had something in there called uh, uh, Vid VidCon. So I went to see, sort of see what this whole VidCon thing was ab all about. And um, from there, I, you know, checked out a couple of the pages. You can sort of see my history and see uh, where I went uh, uh, um, a couple hours ago. Well, actually, I'll, you know, you can, you can because I leave my history open and you can follow it on YouTube and you can follow it on uh, and you can follow it on Twitter. You can also follow it on um, the uh, videos I play. You can f you can follow it on Facebook because they all sort of sync together. Um, well, I thought I'd do uh, today is um, or actually right now is that uh, I see people. Uh, and this is sort of where I usually end up hanging out with are sort of these uh, people who call themselves geeks and nerds. Uh, and more often than not, they're talking about the books they're reading, so I thought I'd share uh, some of the books that I have. And uh, my reading, it, it, these are just, you know, uh, I have a, uh, I said I'm, I, I'm a freegan, and so I got a lot of stuff, my stuff out of the garbage, and I was able to pick out uh, a bookcase that fit in the bathroom so instead of having a small uh, holding basket for magazines I now have a whole bookcase and my bathroom reading includes this book here there it is this is my bathroom reading mechanisms and theories in organic chemistry so these are the, these are the reads that I enjoy um, I still do enjoy uh, the occasional uh, uh, fiction novel, but uh, more often than not, uh, that, you know that's the one I'm reading. The other one I'm reading is a book on algorithms. You know, this is kind of essential to computer science, so I go over it. I go over it every now and again um, to sort of keep my uh, uh, my computer science chops uh, up to date. Oh, well, it's sort of like uh, mental exercises for the mind. So then I have uh, over there a uh, physics problem solver. It's a big thick book like that uh, where I continually do go back over and over again and work on uh, different phys pro physics problems. And that leads me into uh, you know uh, thinking about uh, the nature of the universe and the various different construction, the various different constructs uh, in terms of how we think about the universe uh, actually are put together and then from there uh, I, I, you know, try to sort of uh, put together my ideas, uh, you know, as, as a physicist, as a natural physicist uh, it's not simply uh, sufficient to watch somebody else do the work, but you have to sort of come up with your own ideas as well. And uh, I've done pretty well so far. It's just, it's just that uh, it takes an enormous amount of uh, time to sort of sift through everything. Um, was, uh, I, I'm starting to redo how I... Uh, write and publish, so these are the, vi the, the videos will be coming up for that, 
but I'm also going to be redoing my websites, my web pages. All everything is going to going to be redone. I'm sort of still in the process of that, and just to get myself into a good position where I can start doing things, it's about six months worth of work. So um, that sort of leaves uh, me uh, here and sort of at this point in time. Uh, chugging along, trying to get as much done as I can during the, you know, each day. You have a list of work that has to get done, and you just go down the list and do as much as you can. Uh, sometimes you get everything done, sometimes you don't. Like today, I wasn't able to get everything I wanted to get done, so some of the stuff gets pushed off t tomorrow. Uh, I was supposed to do more work on cyborgs and cybernetics today, that didn't happen. I was looking at some of uh, my uh, audio issues that I've been having, uh, trying to resolve those, and then from there, I want to uh, try uh, different uh, techniques to put in uh, you know, for these type of videos. I want to try to put in different type of types of graphics. Uh, I might get to my first graphics tomorrow. We'll see how that works. I wasn't able to do it today uh, to do uh, the graphic overlays. And then from there, once I get the graphic overlays in, it's a matter of uh, practicing and timing out um, how you want your v the different video segments to turn out. So that's going to be done tomorrow. So that the, uh, tomorrow is going to be a sort of a practice editing day where uh, I'm going to try out some new techniques, some new um, some new video ideas, uh, and then we'll see what happens. So anyway, uh, that's it for about now. Uh, I seem to be getting very tired. So anyways. I will try to get to some of my comments tomorrow. And I know there are a couple I do want to talk about, so I've got them all listed. I've got you, uh, you know, the ones in, in my wiki notes. I've got the, the various different comments that I want to say in the wiki notes. Uh, like I said, I've got the Omega Construct in the wiki notes. Uh, I'm working on uh, actually now two, sh two new shows. Uh, for phys the for the physics TV channel, uh, I'm still working on the uh, NASA the NASA the weekly NASA NASA ma the weekly NASA magazine, but I'm also going to do one uh, a, a weekly physics magazine to sort of show what's going on in in the world of physics and astronomy. So that's going to be the focus there. Uh, I sort of figured that out as I was doing the uh, sort of looking over what was what I had for NASA, and as I was going also as I was going through the cyborgs and cybernetics, uh, it popped up with uh, the uh, chip design f that I Intel is working on for uh, several years down the road, and uh, that all involves physics. So rather than uh, keeping the chip design under computers, or, or any of the computers, the compu the, the, the uh, you know, uh, the Ubuntu BSD uh, Unix Intel program, or on the cyborgs and cybernetics, uh, I'm moving that the chip design into um, a, a new program uh, that's going to cover uh, the, the sort of uh, material science which will include uh, chip uh, engineering. So that was sort of where that's going to be going because it uses the technique that they're, they're talking about, uh, and this is more about for, for uh, purposes of memory, about uh, the using some of those SMT, oh, STM, yeah, um, scanning, tunneling, sc scanning, tun scanning, tun tunneling, money, micro scanning, tunneling microscope. It's, uh, it's, it's a type of microscope that allows them to actually sort of really get down to the atomic layers. And I said, if you want to hear more about this or you have some uh, interest in this and how, uh, where 
this really uh, uh, atomic level mic uh, mic microsc microscopy is going. Uh, this will be in the uh, uh, in the in the uh, the uh, f the Physics Weekly magazine. Anyways, uh, I'll talk to you a little bit later on today, uh, and I'm gonna try to get some more comments up. All right, see you later.